This week in Louisiana agriculture, one of the state's most well-known family-run dairies is destroyed by a massive explosion. We'll have details. Young cattlemen from across the nation visit Louisiana for a taste of Southern hospitality. I'm Kristen Oaks and I'll have that story coming up. I'm A.J. Sabine. I'll introduce you to the third and final finalist for the Louisiana Farm Bureau's Young Farmer and Rancher Achievement Award. Hello everyone, I'm Michael Dana. Thanks so much for joining us. Smith Creamery of Mount Hermon, Louisiana in Tangibahoe Parish was destroyed by a massive explosion in the early morning hours of June 21st. According to WWL Radio in New Orleans, the explosion may have been caused by a fire that set off a 600-gallon propane tank in a part of the plant that also stores diesel fuel. Whenever I saw it, the whole, every, the top and everything was gone. The north end of the building was gone. It destroyed everything. So we just, uh, we just don't know what to do or what we will do or what we can do. You know, we just don't know. Sandra and Warren Smith were one of hundreds of struggling Louisiana dairy farmers when in 2000 they decided to vertically integrate their operation by turning milk into retail products that included non-homogenized milk, butter, and Creole cream cheese. The investigation into the explosion is continuing. We'll have a complete story for you next week. In the meantime, the Breda Farmers Market here in Baton Rouge has set up a relief fund for the Smiths. You can visit our website at twilighttv.org and we'll link you to the Breda site.